In this video, I will explain how to solve the, the question 24, uh, 54 of the GRE math subject area, which is a simple probability question. Now they say we, if the real number x is chosen at random in the interval 0, 3, and a real number y is chosen at random in the interval 0, 4, what is the probability that y that x is less than y or y is greater than x. Let's see here. Let's see the multiple choices here. I don't care about them right now. But let's do it. Let's do something here. I'm doing a rectangle here. Now let's say this is the x number and the y number they say the this is three here okay one two three and if you want to three and four and now they say that the x's are between zero and three and the y is between zero and four but we need to find the probability that the y is greater than the x if we do the line y equal x, we have three here, one, two, three. We need to find the probability that a random point in this rectangle is gonna be above this line here, which is gonna be in the region. Now it's easy to find, we, we found that the area of that region and divide by 12, which is the area of the whole rectangle. And let's do that. Now the area of the top region is gonna be the whole rectangle minus this triangle here, the area of this triangle here, which is a three, three by three. Now we have the whole rectangle area is 12 minus the Red triangle, the the red triangle here. The area is gonna be three times three times three. The, we will have the base for times the high, which is three times three times divided by two. Everything divided by twelve. Uh, this is the probability that y is greater than x. Which is the question. I'm gonna put 12 at the bottom of everything and they're gonna have 12 divided by 12 minus three times three, which is nine divided by two times 12. And then it's gonna be one minus nine divided by three, uh, three and 12 divided by, by three, four. I mean, three, two times four. And now we have one minus a three over eight and equals eight least common denominator with, and then we have eight minus three which is five over eight and this is the answer for this question meaning that the answer in the multiple choice is c they say like about 52 percent of people have it right This is a simple probability question. It's only finding the areas and divide by the total area. Thank you.